Hey everyone, Jose here, and here at Yugatech, we've checked out countless routers in all shapes and sizes over the years. Today, we're diving into a new breed of networking hardware, the secure cloud-managed Wi-Fi 6E router, the Zysel AXE5400, or the SCR50AXE. We were a bit skeptical at first, thinking this would just be another network product with all the standard bells and whistles. But to our surprise, there is something unique about this router that you need to know. So. I suggest you watch on to find out. So for those of you who don't know, Zysel is a Taiwanese leader in networking with over 30 years of experience, delivering cutting edge solutions and networking technology. They cater to small offices or home office environments, aka Soho, offering a diverse range of products, including switches, wireless access points, and security or VPN firewalls. But Zysel's offering extend beyond Soho environments providing tailored solutions for small to medium-sized businesses and even large enterprises across various industries like surveillance, hospitality, and education. One of their secure cloud-managed routers is the Zysel AXE5400 scr 58 e Wi-Fi 6E router. It packs vital security features like advanced malware and ransomware protection, traffic management, country restriction, and detailed threat reporting capabilities. It promises an easy setup through its dedicated mobile app and delivers blazing fast connectivity with speeds of up to 5.4 gigabytes thanks to its tri-band Wi-Fi 6E radio. For enhanced security, the ser 50 axe offers secure site-to-site -site connectivity for remote work, easy guest network access, and simple cloud management through Zysel's Nebula platform. There's also an optional subscription plan called the SCR Pro Pack license that unlocks even more powerful features. So when you buy one of these routers, what do you get? Well, unboxing the Zysel scr 50 axe reveals the router itself, an Ethernet cable, a power adapter, and a stand kit for flexible placement. As for the router itself, the scr 50 axe Wi-Fi 6E router that we have is predominantly matte white, and it has a rectangular body with rounded corners. Delivers a modern twist from traditional router designs, and we can't help but imagine it as a flying saucer that's standing vertically. So, flying saucer. The router's magnetic base easily connects to the included stand kit, allowing for wall mounting or vertical positioning. For I.O., it includes four NAN ports, a single WAN port, and a 12-volt DC power input, along with the reset and WPS buttons. In front, you can find five LED indicators for power, LAN, internet, Wi-Fi, and WPS that illuminate blue, green, red, or yellow, depending on the device's connection status. Now at the back or below, depending how you position the router, you'll find the device info, default Wi-Fi admin credentials, and a QR code for registering the device to Nebula. Now, earlier I mentioned the Zysel ser 50 axe comes with an optional subscription plan. While this subscription provides more advanced features, their base free account still has all the essentials most consumers will need to protect their network. Now, let's break down the differences between the free subscription plan and the SCR Pro Pack. The free tier includes almost all essential security features like malware prevention, ad blocking, a firewall, and traffic management, among others. Meanwhile, the SCR Pro Pack license, which costs 2,900 pesos for a one-year subscription, grants access to comprehensive website filtering based on content categories. It also upgrades to ransomware prevention premium for real-time threat intelligence, offering the best protection, and includes advanced Nebula Pro features. If you want to test drive the Pro feature, you can always take advantage of the 30-day trial upon request. Now, let's move on to setting it up, and it's quite easy. First, connect the provided LAN cable from your existing internet modem router combo to the one port on the Zysel router. Turn it on by plugging in the 12-volt power adapter and wait for the LED indicators to turn green, which signals it's ready. Next, grab your smartphone and download the Nebula app via the Google Play Store or Apple App Store depending on your OS. Zysel even offers a handy video guide on their website just in case you get lost in the process. While setting it up, I noticed the mobile app only showed basic features. To access the rest, you need the Zysel router admin portal interface. By the way, it is worth mentioning that you need to create an account. Once you're logged in, head to configure, security router, which is found on the left side panel. Here, you can activate features like malware prevention, intrusion blocking, and even ad blocking for enhanced security. You can also navigate to traffic management under the same menu. Any changes you make in the web interface instantly syncs with the mobile app. Speaking of the mobile app, let's go through it rather quickly. The app's navigation bar features five key sections. 
home Wi-Fi device clients and settings. The home screen displays device information, including one status, firmware version, and connection details. You can even see which devices are using your network and the total number of connected clients. It's also features with just showcasing the most active clients, threat management, and recent threat events. While rearranging these widgets isn't currently possible, they do provide useful insights at a quick glance. Moving on to the Wi-Fi section. Here you can create up to four SSIDs with customizable names and choose between 2.4 gigahertz, five or six gigahertz bands, thanks to the router's Wi-Fi 6E support. Now, the device sections show compatible Zycel devices connected to your network like mobile routers, switches, and other access points. Selecting a device provides status, a live connection speed checker, and a handy remote read option. You also find detailed information like available ports, model name, serial number, MAC address, and network configuration details here. The best part of the app is the client section. This window provides all the security features. Here, you can monitor all connected devices, their data usage, app access, and even see security event logs detailing block threats like malware, phishing attempts, and unauthorized access attempts. This level of detail comes in handy for larger networks like ours here at the Ubitech HQ. We made this ISIL router our main hub next to our ISP router, connecting the other routers to its LAN ports. This setup allows us to monitor all network activity across our entire studio, from all access points to even individual routers. Now, what we love about the app is the ability to monitor data bandwidth usage by application. That said, we weren't too surprised to see that Dropbox and social media platforms were our top five bandwidth consuming applications accessed by our team. We were surprised to find that the router blocked a significant amount of potentially harmful activity, including malware, phishing attempts, and unauthorized access attempts, which really just helps save and protect our site. While the app offers a great overview, more in-depth information such as which ads or URLs are being blocked are available on the Nebula dashboard, the web interface of their admin panel. Similar to interfaces you'd find on most routers, the panel offers more info and configuration options than the mobile app mentioned earlier. It's where users will find advanced settings and configurations for customizing and fine-tuning their network to their liking. Here, you can manage firewall rules, prioritize devices, optimize performance, and see all the detailed information about what the router does from the back end. It has a user-friendly interface that features colorful charts and data analytics typically found in enterprise-grade routers, making it easy to understand and navigate for regular consumers just like you and me. Interestingly, using the Zycel router as our primary hub allowed us to enjoy the full bandwidth speed from our internet provider, even with multiple devices connected. This was a significant improvement compared to our old setup where switching to another access point was often necessary in order to have faster speeds. Overall, the Zycel SCR 50 axe is not your typical old-fashioned router. Its user-friendly setup process and interactive dashboard, which are available on both web and mobile, make it ideal for beginners who don't want to dive into all the technical jargons of setting up a router. With the addition of their vast ecosystem combined with a secure cloud platform, regular updates, future firmware, even bugs can be easily addressed with just the click of a button. For small and medium-sized businesses, the Zycel SCR 50 axe makes configuring essential security features a breeze with just a few clicks. This compact design makes it ideal for small offices and home offices, unlike other bulkier routers in its class. It's especially useful for those on a tight budget but still need enhanced security in their network without a hefty price tag. Typically, implementing such security features would require complex setup and IT expertise, but with the Zycel's SCR 50 axe it's as easy as plug and play and just follow the instructions. And from there, users will have immediate access to its full range of security benefits with very minimal effort. Now you're probably wondering, how much does this cost? If you're interested in this router, the Zycel SCR 50 axe is priced at 17,999 pesos and is available on their official website, Lazada and Shaw pages. But there is a special offer for Yucatec viewers. Zycel is offering a special discount on their products through their official channels that will run until April 25, 2024. To redeem the discount, simply visit the Zycel official store on Shopee or Lazada and use the voucher code ZYCEL2024 at checkout. So after hearing all of that, what do you think about cloud-based routers like the Zycel SCR? 50 AXE. Let us know in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this video or found it least informative, do give us a like and subscribe to our channel to watch more videos like this one.
Also, don't forget to follow us on our social media channels such as Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and TikTok and visit NewGetEch.com to stay updated with the latest tech news and reviews. Once again, this has been Jose and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Stay safe out there.